Jude Law has been called the sexiest man alive and Hollywood's busiest actor. The two-time Oscar nominee puts both of those titles to work in the new romantic comedy, The Holiday, where Law stumbles upon the doorstep of Cameron Diaz, a woman trying to escape her life. You're not Iris. Or if you are, I'm much drunker than I realized. I'm sorry for my profanity. I wasn't expecting uh, you. <laughs> no, I wasn't expecting you either. Ah, uh, nevertheless, may I just... Oh, yeah, of course, sure, you had to... Yeah. Oh, I'm Graham, Iris's brother. Oh, brother. Um, I, well, I'm Amanda Woods. I'm staying here. Amanda Woods? Is that all one word? <laughs> no. No, it's not. Oh. Jude Law, good morning. Good morning. How was it? Your first romantic comedy. <laughs> you made it look easy, but you've said that it really wasn't, Thank you right? for saying that. That's a big compliment, because it isn't. It's, mm -hmm. uh, it's great fun. I right. mean, goodness, you know, um, spending um, every day, all day with Cameron Diaz is, is not hard. Oh, my gosh. But, uh, she sure makes it look easy. She's obviously mm -hmm. done it before and um, is, is just brilliantly skilled at keeping that kind of uh, energy, that sparkle alive. And, but I was, you know what, I sat back and I just, I, I learned a lot. Like what? Well, to, to come into it with a great kind of um, sense of spirit, character. So what was the hardest part for you? Did you find, because you've had these very serious, dramatic roles, very intense. Uh, what was the hardest part for me? Yeah. Well, uh, probably, actually, if I told you what was the hardest part, it would be revealing too much about the character, because this character's got a great twist. Uh-huh. You think he's one thing, and in fact he's another, and so I'm not going to reveal anything. Oh, you're not? <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> <I'm> not, sorry. <laughs> Let's tell people a little bit about the movie that we can tell them about. All yeah, right. it, I play Kate Winslet's brother. Mm -hmm. And Kate and Cameron's character swap houses over the right. Christmas holidays. Both of them escaping uh, their rather tragic love lives. Mm -hmm. And both of them hoping not to bump into any men. And, of course, the first night they're both there, they meet. That's uh, exactly what happens, right? Yeah. So you show up at, at her doorstep in the scene we just saw. And what happens? Um... <laughs> you really want me to give it all away. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. <laughs> Come on, tell Go me something. All yeah. right, all right. <laughs> Nancy Myers, you mentioned, who does these films so well, she yeah. actually had you watch some Cary Grant films, right? To yeah, prepare well, we discussed, for this? You know, I mean, I think, I think it's a, a, a tricky type of film to pull off nowadays. We both agree that the best period at pulling this kind of romantic comedy off was the sort of late 40s, 50s, and Cary Grant's performances in, in, in films like Arsenic and Old Lace mm -hmm. and The Awful Truth. And we just discussed the quality that he had, this uh, ability to, I don't know, be generous, but still very much the kind of the, the guy in the movie and mm -hmm. his humour, which never took away from him, his kind of, uh, his weight as an actor. And mm -hmm. so, I mean, you know, that's... If someone says, go, go, go sit down and watch all Cary Grant's movies, it's not, it's not a hard piece of research. Right, me. right. You've got, you've got some other fantastic things on your plate. You're teaming up with Anthony Minghella again. I am, He directed yeah. you to both of your Oscar nominations. He did. And you're going to get together for Breaking and Entering. What's that about? We shot this... Uh, first of all, Anthony came, came back to me um, for the third time, <laughs> and so I knew I'd done something right. And it was a very different type of film to the last two. Uh, much smaller budget, smaller scale, mm -hmm. contemporary. And we shot it in and around London, in fact, the area where we both live. Oh, that must have been nice for you with the it kids. It was. I walked to work. It was your, lovely. Mm -hmm. You had the kids nearby, your three kids. My children were able to come down and visit occasionally, yeah. And I was, could finish in time to go run home and pick them up from school. And what are you guys doing for the holidays? We you and the kids. Africa. You're, now, you've done that before with yeah. the kids, right? Yeah, I went last... Actually, not for Christmas, but just mm -hmm. before Christmas last year. I read you said that was one of your best memories ever. Yeah, with your it was family. extraordinary. Tanzania, we went oh, to. Wow. This year, we're going to South Africa. Great. Anybody mm. else going? No, just just the three of well, the three of them and me. Nice, yeah. nice. Have a happy holiday. Thank you. You too. Yeah, it's great to meet you, and you're so funny and charming. I think you should do more romantic comedies. Oh, well, we'll see how this one goes down. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good. <laughs> it's called The Holiday. Jude Law. Nice to meet you. Thank you. You too.